This presentation will be based on the assumption that implants properly placed perform better than implants poorly placed. But this is an opinion. Maybe you have the same opinion. But we don't have the evidence. We don't have an RCT that proves that. The assumption is that if the dentists were wiser, probably we would have less biological complications. And you see there are none of these are Stroman implants. And it's not because I wanted to be polite, but because I really feel that on average, a Stroman user, through the benefit of the ATI, has tried to do things in a proper way. Other companies were struggling for fireworks, for promising everything now, today, yesterday. And ITI has given us the opportunity to think twice, to make sure things were done properly, thinking in the long term. So the idea, in my opinion, of the new dentistry, which is based not on the opinion, I was, to be honest, very shocked to see Albert, Albert's own presentation today, but it's based on the consensus. And I'm very pleased today to start with the uh, Albertson consensus, where they related crest and bone loss, they don't want to call it perimplantitis, call it wherever you want, but they related these problems to a number of factors, namely the implant, the clinician, the patient, and the foreign body reaction. And, uh, I like very much the fact that they talk about clinician and they talk about experience, skill, ethics. How can we have evidence on ethics?